Mr. Brown, you cannot go out there in socks. I'm finding. His, his shoes are still, we still, it don't matter. It don't matter that Papa has died, he has still lost his shoes. Maybe even more so. Okay, can we wear, can we wear these? Those are those that will make me get water in my suit, on my car. Okay, so you want your snow boots or your water boots? Here, lucky us. Yes, Papa, it's funny. Wait, where are you going? I'm going to get Papa. Oh my god. Apple spray. And he's he's left the uh okay. Now what's that for? The cow. They don't eat apples. I shouldn't say that. Alright. Okay, good. That's for the cows. I don't need to be a dream crusher. Reality crushes enough dreams. He doesn't need a dad to crush them for him. Speaking of dad, if you haven't been around, he died on, uh, what is today? Uh, Tuesday. Today's Tuesday, he died Sunday. Two days ago. Finally got my ugly cry in this morning. Came out of nowhere. My ugly cry, my old Rebecca tight cry. Same one I did with my granny when she died. Hey, wait, I thought we gotta go get the cows, honey. But I'm putting this in here for her to ride in the stanchion. Okay. All right, that's good, that's good enough. Let's cover it, let's go get them. Come here. Can you move the luchadors? No. Okay. I thought you called them the luchadors. <laughs> you can call them the luchadors if you want. I like to call them the luchadors, it's Spanglish. <laughs> For, I believe you'd say it, luchador. Eh? Yeah. Oh, thank you for holding my hand. Okay, where are we going? That way. We gotta go over. Yeah, we can't go any further. I'm gonna help you. Of course. Okay, ready, kids? Jonah, one on either side, please. Ready? One, two, two three. three. That's not that hard. Go, 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 go. How's that? Oh, that's good. Is that good? That's a great patch of ground. And that system is working out amazing. It keeps the ram from breeding our ewes. We want to strategically breed them at a certain time. Now's not it. <laughs> Dweebs. <laughs> Blasting. Yeah, and, and what we, is that? we put it's leaf walnuts. And we put yeah, and, and we put it sawdust in. <laughs> all right, all right. That's what you guys do for fun. Beats Fortnite. Yeah. Can you put the lane up, Birdo? Okay. Hey, you guys didn't put the lane up down there. Can you please go do that? I asked. I asked. We're all having to have more uh, mercy than usual. And it's hard when you're at the weakest moment. Let's go get moose. It, it may not be worth it to try to keep the other cows from not coming. It's so much better if they don't. Hey kids, will you guys stand up there above and on the perimeter? No cow will get you over there, okay? Stop them. I'm gonna herd Phyllis down. Then you just herd moose down and he'll go under the fence. Okay. No Alright, that's not a bad idea. This is true, Jonah. Hey, are you sure he'll leave the herd? Yep. Hey, don't rush her, Josiah. Wait. Let the calf be able to see her there. This is not a terrible idea. Moose will go under these these cow fence. Okay, so we're not gonna we're not gonna rope halter him. Okay. Good morning, Aunt Flossie. Good morning, Moose. I try to let the kids give input. They sit in sense of feel, feel a sense of ownership. And sometimes Jonah's right. It's why, it's Jonah. It's why Moose is in there at night with the sheep, which is wonderful. It's been working out amazing. 
And Jonah, he hasn't read any of the permaculture textbooks. He hasn't read about sheep or cows. He hasn't gone to any lectures or classrooms. See, I guess it's good to be open to people's ideas. No matter how much experience they have. Or head knowledge. Because sometimes he's still got, sometimes young people still have common sense. <laughs> common sense. Okay, hang on, Jana, 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 wait. Uh, okay. I should just go back in and have some tea. I'm messing everything up. <laughs> okay, no, what I need to do is say, what do you need me to do, John? <laughs> Right. You know that clubhouse I'm making, Papa? Yeah. I'm going to map out our whole farm on it, in it, and get our fishing Oh, okay. Okay. Look where the cows are going it's next. It's under. Look, Moose knows. No, he's trying to, is he trying to nurse, nurse, uh, <laughs> no, that, those aren't teats, uh, st uh Moose. <laughs> you better keep moving, buddy. You're going to get nursed. Hey, let's go down to Mom. Uh, it might not work, Jonah. Huh. Huh. Uh, maybe it's kind of. He doesn't know where she is. I wish she wouldn't have got rushed down. I wanted her to see him, to see her. Keep him, keep him down, Jonah. Get in. You stay there. That's good. Jonah, Jonah, catch him. I guess if you catch him, that's good. If you can't catch him, just do it. Your mom's down here, buddy. One day we're gonna have this. All these lanes, four strands. And then all we have to do is herd him into the lane. That's what we need to do. He still had not seen us caught wind of his mouth. Here? Look, look at him react. He heard that. Oh. oh no! We got all the way down here. Hey! Okay, now the trick is to not get upset when you do, <laughs> when you do your child's idea and it doesn't work. It is annoying. But until we have, he's saying, it's annoying to have to herd them all down. It, it is. We have such a small herd, it's hard to separate them, anybody. Next time, it might have worked better if we kept Phyllis up here. But maybe not. It would have. There we go. Sometimes you also got to listen to the animals. What do they want? They don't want to be separated? Well, don't separate them. And things will go smoother for you. be no problem getting him down here now the problem is managing all them when we only need one <laughs> well need milk one cow what to do with everybody else catch this calf Lily you're the whisperer go ahead and bring him out bring him out need a little help yeah You go grab his tail. There you go. Down to the vet. You give that to her, Lily. Who are you giving that to? You give that to Phyllis. This one is stubborn. Which, by the way, he's meat for us. We've, we've eaten bear now at this point. He was delicious. We were a little nervous because Violet said it tasted so terrible. But Violet, I guess, didn't have an ounce of fat. And Bear was in much better shape. And he was delicious, wasn't he? Yeah. We had a steak. Oh, I think it was the best steak I ever had. Good. I can both eat it. Did you get moose some? Yeah. I got them some too. Ow. Hey, somebody bring me a, uh, bring me the, the pails and the, the water, please. Go for it, Lily. Papa would be proud. And my grandpa would be proud too. I didn't, I never even knew him. Died at 56. At least my dad didn't die at 56. 30 extra years with him. I wonder how, how many times, how long it's, I'm gonna come and milk every single day and, 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 and think of him. I think milking will remind, I'll, I'll be reminded of him every, every time. And his last handshake, his last, 
Handshake was strong as an ox two days before he died. His moms and dads was strong before him. And now you see what's happening? <laughs> hey, you see what's happening? Fourth generation of uh, mighty handshakers. <laughs> Look at that. Lily. It was grandpa. It was grandpa and granny. I hope she didn't kick me in the head. <laughs> it was grandpa and granny. And then my dad. And then me. And then Lily. Fourth generations. A mighty handshake. Strongest handshake in the county. And we certainly got less competition these days, don't we? I have light gray dropped on her. Uh oh, I'm stuck in here, I think. <laughs> Dog be over, please. At least he's got his shoes on. Oh, yeah, he does. Now Ow. get out. You know, really. My turn. Everybody's kind of just fooling around. My turn. <laughs> Normally, I'd be giving them something to do. But it's nice to have them all around. It's nice to have them all around. All right, bring, bring, bring Moose in. Come on, Lily. Let's let's move away. Jean, can you move? So we've milked her, but I know there's more. Even though she gave us quite a bit. A gallon and three quarters, maybe. We don't. It would be good if I had an office and help figure out where the cows were going next. That's fine. That'd be great. You can make your little office over there. Okay, look how much more we got, guys. Here, Lily. Hold this up for me. Hold that up, babe. All right, let's see what we got. We got a full Woo! bucket. Woo! Two gallons. Everybody say, Woo! <laughs> you know what? Sun's coming up. Pop used to say, today is the first day of the rest of my life. So, let's be happy in it. Hey, you, did you guys find Papa's old pictures? Yeah. Look, look, look at that hunk of a man. That was him sitting on the swing. I believe that's my two younger sisters. That's our dog. That's our dog. Do you guys know who that that's, is? That's um, Big Daddy and that's um, Papo. Yeah, let's see if they can tell me who this is. Can you guys see who that is? That's Papo. Who's that long haired kid in there? You. <laughs> hey. What? Do you want to go with? I'm driving. Um, we're going to drive Sally. Say hey, hey Bells. Hey. Birdell, you coming with? I nicknamed her Birdell because that's actually my granny's name. Coming. So that's an honor of her. Hey, Grandma. Uh, hi. Ooh. Good morning. We have the kitty cats. Yes. I'm glad we have Sally right now. We just all need to be together even more now, don't we? Oh, Mr. Brown. What? Where are your shoes? <laughs> oh! <laughs> hey, you can't come out in your socks. You gotta either go barefoot or find your shoes. Do you guys have any idea where Mr. Brown put his shoes? Nope. I bet they're in the house. Hey, Mr. Brown, did you take them off up to the house? Yep. <laughs> okay. Hey, Sally was worth every penny this morning just to have all y'all together, working together. Fuller wouldn't be this good. No, four wheeler wouldn't have been this cool. Oh, don't drop the file. Yeah, you can have one. We bellied out. How you doing this morning? Doing all right. Good. I'm really overwhelmed all the time. Well, thank you, Grandma, for stepping up and helping us get breakfast ready. You look cute in your apron. Thanks. This is a nice floral setup. Finished with the edit. It is 2.30 in the afternoon. Got more family stuff tonight, so we're actually doing pretty good. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get this these chores out of the way. Let's see what you've been doing, buddy. Okay. Well, I got a new tool. Yeah? So it's up here. I'm going to show you it. 
any of the door here? You including Lily? Yeah. Good. Oh my gosh. I built a wall. You built a wall. You know, Grandpa's idea for an office in here was pretty cool, right? Yeah. This is kind of cool. But this is where the bank's gonna be. And the, the fire what? hole, the bank. Board. Oh my gosh. It's my vacuum cleaner. A battery powered shop back. Cool. Started Sally. I swear, this might be the biggest tool I've discovered for keeping the family together. Yeah. Doing the work on the farm. Because you guys can't keep up with my walking pace, can you? No. That was handy. We went and got it all, got the fencing stuff all the way from the top of the mountain. This is for our temporary day paddocks. Hey, Papa? Yes, honey. You know I can run the farm in the paddock. Oh, for sure. We got our paddock up. Jonas, should we get the cows down or the water down first? Uh, water down. Grab our reel. We shouldn't stay there in case we need it. No, let's keep it because I would have never remembered it was there, honey. Yeah, Who I knows how long it's been there? No, I just put it there. Oh. Yeah, I remember when the grass was so Let's cold. take it. Hey, kids! I'm about to go on Sally! Woo! Oh, they're there. Okay. Man, just back and forth with Sally. Went up to the barn to get the waterer. Why was it up there? I don't, I don't remember. I don't remember why. We have a waterer for every pasture. Jonna, what are you getting? Oh, there it is. Oh no, those boards are not big enough, sweetie. Together they are. <laughs> I don't think so, but we can try. Come on, do you have a quick connect? Yep. I could be wrong. I think so. Maybe, here, wash it out. All right, we got our water filling up. Let's go get the cows. Scabbers. Come on. Where's your baby? Where's your baby? Oh, there he is, <laughs> right behind her. Since we're going right by the stall, it's gonna be easier to put moose up in the stall tonight than with the sheep. This should be super easy move since we're moving all of them. All right, we got moose in there. He still, he still remembered it. All right, they're, they're happy to go down this lane. Fresh grass. Wanna put a sheep in there with him? It's our, tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Well, there you go. All right, let's go move the sheep. Wow, 4.15, okay. Jonah, we have, we're headed, we're, we're doing good. I'm working on my thing. Let's see where mom's at and have supper ready for her when she gets here. Donald loves his little throne. <laughs> his little compost pile throne. <laughs> He's always on that thing. Oh my, oh my. What's going on here? Oh my, pick up the trash. Pick up the trash, Mr. Brown. First time it pops without pop. Hey. Well, you've cleaned it up so nice. Oh yeah. Looks really good. Hey, and we How don't have uh, I'm good. The oxygen stuff Yeah, going. no oxygen uh, noise. It's quiet. Strong woman. Oh, no, I'm just in big denial. It'll hit. <laughs> oh. It'll hit, Miss Rachel. It'll hit. It will. Hey, baby girl. Hey. I know all of them. She's <laughs> and more. <laughs> How about you? Can I give little girls kisses too, like that? And go, mm, 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 or not? My boss chair. They love you. Right. Hey, oh, is this the chair? This is the chair. Oh. Get you. Rebecca scanning in photos tonight for the. It's been late nights, guys. Meeting with family. It's been great. Um. But then working on stuff like s slideshows. For the funeral, I need to work on my speech at some point. Um, what was I gonna say here? Oh yes, gosh, this is gonna be like, ah, oh, this is crazy. This whole week, we're gonna promote our physical merchandise, guys. If it's one thing we learned at Homesteaders of America, is you guys want more of that. And boy, we giving it to you. We're bringing back our Great American Farm Tour t-shirts, 
our mugs. We're bringing out uh, stainless steel cups. My goodness. J plus L. Uh, no. Guys. J plus R. Why did I say J plus L? Because your brain isn't working. Oh, boy. Okay, anyway, this is like the worst <laughs> announcement ever. I guess you guys can understand where I'm coming from. Anyway, maybe I should just say this. Go check it out, guys. We have a whole new website. It's all our physical merchandise. So, y y you know, what if you what if you don't want like the learning material? Well, you can get mugs. We got the oh the the Pigs for Everyone T-shirt is out, and Rebecca does got a new T-shirt. It's called Homestead Mama. So this is like our first, guys. We're branching out into T-shirts for you guys. I should just be quiet. Just go check out the website. Hopefully it speaks for yourself. My assistant Heather did a wonderful job on that. Thank you, Heather. So you, that was like the worst pitch ever. I'm sorry, I hope you'll forgive me. Maybe this will make up for it. For every sale from now on in my business, doing it for boots, one, one dollar for every sale, one tree for every sale. Mark it down, worst pitch ever. <laughs> but you guys are, we love you. We, you understand what we're going through. You have mercy for us. Check that out. We're, the reason we're pushing this now is if you wanna get this stuff by Christmas, you need to order by November 10th. And At, if you want it, cause like the t-shirts Maybe not. you can pitch this a little bit better, Becky. <laughs> so the reason is, is like right now we have to so we're ordering the t-shirts yeah and then we're and the gonna DVD, and the, the dvds Book and stuff DVD. but we're gonna have some extra t-shirts on hand but if you want to make sure that we have you get a specific size like we can't we That's don't right. we don't know what the sizes There's are no gonna guarantees. be yeah oh dad sorry sorry that was that that really was the worst pitch ever but you know as well as I do, these people really love us and they don't care. And many of them, bless y'all's heart, many of you guys just want to support us in any way. You don't care what the product is. We thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that. We feel it from the bottom of our heart and we could not do this. We could not create this YouTube content and run this business without you guys. You guys make it all possible. So I thank you. Huge. Papa Bear virtual hug for all you guys, all you customers who make this possible.